Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. That is a really blue shirt I got on. Anyways, I'm gonna try to make this one a quick one. Today, we are going to the range and we're checking out Remington Corelock tipped in the 6.5 Creedmoor. So let me show you these real quick. You probably saw the little green tips in the intro there. Remington Corelock tips, just like it's in the name, they have that tip on there. Gives them a higher BC, flatter shooting, less drop at longer distances. Hey, I've tested this stuff in a bunch of different cartridges. 270, 243, seven millimeter mag. And I've got a couple more I'm working on finding so we can film them too. But coming up on deer season, I'm trying to film as much of the hunting blue lights as I can. Tons of them, you guys been asking me to film them. This one especially, you guys been saying, get the tipped in 6.5 Creedmoor. We got some, we're filming it today. I'll hurry up and show you what I'm doing so we can get to the good part. I got two 6.5 Creedmoors today. We're testing the Corelock tipped in. This is my Ruger American. You guys that watch the channel are familiar with this. I just got a real budget friendly Nikon Pro Staff P3 on here. On this one, I've got my Banish 30 Gold. That's a suppressor from Sound Through Central. Super, super sweet rig. It's gonna be quiet. Then on this one, this is a Weatherby Mark 5 Hunter, fantastic, 6.5 Creedmoor as well. On top of this one, I have a Zero Tech Thrive HD, super nice piece of glass. And on this one, I have my Banish 46 Suppressor, also from Silencer Central. So, two 6.5 Creedmoors, going to do my best to do good squeezes across the board and test out this Remington Corelock Tipped. In 6.5 Creedmoor, go take it out to 100 yards, 200 yards, slow down, do my best to see how good I can get it to group out of these two blue light slingers. Come along with me. Let's see what I can do. See how good this stuff groups. All the other stuff I've tested has been pretty good when it comes to that tipped blue lights, but let's see what happens with this stuff out of my two 6.5 Creedmoors. Should be pretty cool. I think I saw grass fly. <laughs> All right, so you guys saw the footage there. How did we do? I think we did pretty good. I just measured these targets with the calipers. Check it out. So, two three shot groups out of each at 100 yards and 200 yards. First, the root, this is the 100 yard uh, target right here. The Ruger American. First one, 
I got a 0.7 inch group. Two actually went in the same hole, but still uh, a 0.77 inch group there. Most people's book, that's pretty good. But the second attempt, I did even better. That is the second three shot group out of the Ruger American. The 0.47 inch group, three almost touching. That's pretty good. Under half an inch at 100 yards, that's borderline fantastic. Now, with that Weatherby Mark V Hunter, this one, I got an exact one inch group, first try, and then my second three shot group with that Weatherby was that 0.71 inch group. So, with both of those 6.5 Creedmoors, I got under a one inch group. 0.4 was the best out of the Ruger. You guys that watch the videos know I'm a big fan of Ruger Americans. They just do good. Like some of them, it's harder to find an ammo that they like better than others. But at the end of the day, out of hundreds and hundreds of videos with these Ruger Americans, hey, they do real good. And uh, if you guys watch all the videos, you would see this Weatherby. I got a 0.3 inch group with the Core Locked Classic at 200 yards. If you missed that video of the Core Locked Classic 6.5 Creedmoor, go check it out with that Weatherby. I got a 0.3 inch group at 200 yards. But at 100 with the Core Locked tipped, under a one inch group with both of these 6.5 Creedmoors, 0.7 with the Weatherby, 0.4 with the Ruger. Now how do we do it? 200, check this out. 200 yards to in most people's book, Get under a two inch group and you're doing pretty good at 200. So how do we do with this core lock tip stuff? Check it out guys. Ruger American, we got a one inch group. Ruger American, always coming in clutch, but hey, I don't care who you are. At 200 yards, a 1.0 inch group is fantastic. So how'd we do on the second try? So on this one, I flung five blue lots. I had one trigger squeeze that I knew was terrible, and I said, hey guys, don't count that one. And then I ended up sending five, so hey, if you're one of those uh, stickler fuds who says you gotta count them all, well, that's a 2.31 inch group. If you only count those three that are closer, we got under an inch with 0.9, but hey, that's what happened with my second attempt, with the first attempt, where I know these were all good squeezes. I got a 1.0 inch group. At 200 yards, I don't care who you are, that's good. Now, how did I do with the Weatherby? The Weatherby didn't like the tip stuff quite as much at 200 yards, but still, not terrible. 2.0 inch group at 200 yards. And then, uh, the second one, not quite as good, a 2.9. So, at 200, Weatherby best group was right at 2 inches. The Ruger best group, we'll call it a 1 inch group. Hey, it's hard to knock. The Ruger Americans. But there you have it, guys. Remington Core Lock Tipped. 6.5 Creedmoor, 129 grain. Hey, a group good for us. Under a half inch group at 100 yards, and we got one inch groups at 200 yards. Just about doesn't get much better than that. But hey, if 6.5 Creedmoor doesn't float your boat, we've done videos. I've been trying to get every cartridge loadings of this tip stuff. So I could film it for you guys. You guys have been asking to see everything. <laughs> We've got a lot of it filmed already. So 6.5 Creedmoor doesn't float your boat. Go check out the channel. Type in Hootie Who or type in Core Lock Tipped on the interwebs. You're bound to find it. We took two deer, actually. My son did with the Core Lock Tipped in 243. Last year, my son took two deer on film with it. So if you want to see us smoking some deers with the tipped, go check out the channel as well. But... Appreciate you guys watching. Make sure you're subscribed. I'm excited about all the videos we got coming real soon. Tons and tons of really fun and cool stuff coming your way. Make sure you're subscribed. Share the videos with your friends. Comment down below what you want to see next time, guys. We'll try to get it in as soon as we can. Appreciate y'all. We got new videos every day. We're working real hard at it. Y'all are the best. Let me know what you think about the Remington Core Lock tip stuff. Hey, group's good for me. It'll smoke a deer. Appreciate y'all. We'll see you on the next one. Woo